getting ready to get their grub on. You know that I am. It's your boy, Mr. Grub, back again with another video for you guys. And today, uh, I'm headed to Wendy's, man. And I'm going to tell you why I'm headed to Wendy's, man. Because I've had a few people hit me up. And believe it or not, these are people from other countries um, that haven't tried it before. So I know I talk a lot about the fast food places, man. Um, but I do want to give them their credit when the credit is due. And like I said, you know, I may not be a big fan a lot of times of fast food. Uh, but they have made names for themselves uh, for reasons. So I'm going to go to Wendy's now because one of their big reasons is the four for four, man. And I know most of you guys may know what that is. But for those of you who don't, I'm going to show you today. So let's head over there now, guys. And let's get this four for four. It's your boy, Mr. Hi, do you guys still have the four for four? Can I have um, the double stack? Four for four. Uh, Sprite. Um, honey mustard, please. Okay. And that'll be all. Thank you. All right, guys. So, unfortunately, you ain't gonna really get to see me eat the Wendy's, and I'm gonna tell you why. So I put my order in, I order my food as you guys saw, you know what I'm saying? I pull up to the window and uh, for some reason, they, I, I, <laughs> this is another reason guys why I, I don't do fast food. And I know I told you guys this before after the Burger King incident um, and I actually took the food that time. Uh, but I can't, I just won't do that a second time. So what basically happened was I order my food, I get up there, they ain't got no no beef ready. Uh, again, another burger place that don't got no beef. I, and it could be my area. Again, I'm not blaming everybody. I'm not blaming the staff, and I'm not going to blame, uh, you know, every Wendy's. But for some reason, I go to Wendy's to get my food, man. I put my order in. Uh, you know, I'm ready, got my cash ready, everything. They tell me they ain't got no beef. So I'm like, okay, cool. Do, do you want something else? Sure. You know what? That's fine. Let me get. You know what? Let me get a. Uh, let me get the chicken sandwich, right? Because they do got a lot of beef on there. You know, junior bacon cheeseburger and stuff like that. So you ain't got no beef, then I know I can't go off of that, right? So I'm like, cool. Let me get a chicken sandwich. Okay. Um, you want spicy or regular? You know, give me regular. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. We only got spicy. Really, nigga? Bruh, really? So, not, so now you want me to just automatically just eat the spicy chicken sandwich because that's what you got. Oh, well, you know, we can substitute it for more chicken nuggets. So, so you got regular chicken nuggets, but you only got spicy chicken. Boy, if you don't get... You know what? I wanted to do it because I wanted to do it for y'all. But that just ain't right. Because, you know, part of my review and part of my rating is also customer service, right? And this is another reason, guys... You know why I always told y'all I'm big on mom and pop and local places because they care about their customers. You know, they try their best to appease their customers, to give them what they're asking for, as well as just make sure their experience is uh, rememberable in a good way. Because if, it's, if you remember them in a bad way, you're never gonna go back, right? So like I said, I haven't been to Wendy's uh, in ages, right? And But I wanted to do it because I, I did want to make sure that you know people who aren't from the US or from other countries that maybe don't have the luxury of eating it will be able to get the review from me and see what it's like and things like that. And I apologize to you guys that I'm not able to give it to you tonight um, only because um, you know, the service wouldn't allow me to. My nigga. <laughs> uh, so I definitely have something for you tomorrow. Maybe I gotta go to a different city and try Wendy's for you, but I definitely have something for you guys tomorrow. Uh, you know, don't worry, I am not gonna forget you. Uh, but definitely, I'm not doing Wendy's tonight <laughs> after that fiasco. So, Wendy's again, I'm not blaming you. Uh, you know, it wasn't every Wendy's, but the one I just so happened to go to today just was not prepared. Uh, you know, to give great customer service, and it's an unfortunate situation, but it is a situation nonetheless. So. Uh, I'm not going to enjoy that. I'm not going to 
you know, uh, act like it was good or I'm not going to give it a, a rating because I didn't get to, you know, have the food or anything like that. So, um, you know, like I said, I'll, I'll try to do something for you guys tomorrow. Uh, maybe find another Wendy's or something like that just to really give you the opportunity to, uh, you know, really know what it's like. Or maybe just try another fast food place. You guys comment below. You let me know what you think I should do or what you think I should try. You know, just to help my people out internationally, let them know, hey, you know, we still have good food. We still have good customer service down here, guys. So you guys give me some ideas. Comment below. All of my newcomers, don't forget to like and subscribe. You know, check the content out. Um, I post content daily for you guys. So, you know, check it out. Let me know what you think. Um, and tomorrow, like I said, I'll be back better than ever with a new video for you guys. Uh, and hopefully at a better location. And, uh, you know, we'll keep, keep this train rolling. This is definitely a funny way to start 2019, though. Uh, the second day in, and I'm running into, uh, you know, a commercial restaurant. That service just wasn't where it should have been. So shout out to my mom and pops, man. You guys are still doing your thing like I said you are. You know, I appreciate you. And I'm definitely going to continue to put you guys on the forefront. Let everybody know just how good you guys are. So until tomorrow, guys. It's your boy, Mr. Grubb. I'm out.